who, by the way, this season haven't missed a thing. Megan DeHamel and Eric Radford, three-time Canadian champions, Grand Prix champions this year, and who knows, someday soon could become world champions. Their best score is the world's top score in the short program, 74 and a half. Skating to music by Jeanette Renault. This choreographed by Julie Marcotte. Triple Lutzes. Their trademark. Perfect unison. Absolutely off the charts. Off the charts. They have become ridiculously good. Well, first of all, technically, the elements are unmatched. To have side-by-side -side triple Lutzes like that, such a high degree of difficulty. More Towers Marinero watching and clapping in respect. And they also capture artistically the feel good of that piece of music connecting with each other, the audience, and bringing this place to life. Wow. Of Luba Ilya Shishkina and Dylan Moskovich, new pairing. They're gonna be second heading into the free skate. There is no denying these two right now. They continue to wow. set the bar wow, yes. technically so high. And when they're out there skating, they are not thinking. They are feeling, they're expressing. You can feel the speed, the power. Here's a look at their side-by-side -side triple lutzes. Nobody else in the world has been doing them and they have perfected them. Here's a look at their throw triple lutz. Nice height. You know, and as she said, it was in control. So right on the edge, they push it but they are able to maintain the control and get the high quality marks. Love this program, a great vehicle done by their choreographer, Julie Marcotte. Look at Eric's position. I mean, Megan is obviously the feature, but Eric is sensational, strong back, 
has the ice coverage, perfect balance, just allowing her to be free and uh, push it to the edge. The short program score. Look at that, the technical score almost matched the high score of the day. 79.5. Incredible, these two have gone from, in a short period of time, good to great. Good to great. 